pretty much my last session at home before I head to uh, National Surfing Championships. I think I get to surf on Monday. I'd way rather be chasing these sort of conditions, guys. Look at that epicness. But more importantly, I want to get that sunrise. As always, thanks for tuning in. I think it's going to be a fun one. It's pretty small. Perfect, though. Um, what more could anyone ask for? I'm very stoked. Let's get out there. Ew. Oh, it's going to surf right here, eh? It's about loud over here, yeah, mate. I'm going to go surf that section over there. There's sections everywhere, not quite sure where to go, but just going to get out there and get to it. I'm going to surf this inside section, I think. Another good session. Uh, hopefully, it's going to commence. I don't have all morning to surf, so I have to get out the water at like at 10. I think it leaves me about two and a half hours. Yeah, no beach camera, so you won't see what it's really doing. But hopefully you can get a couple POV dreamers. That's the goal. It's super fun. I just saw such a crazy one wide, but I think I'm going to go focus on the deep inside. I've seen such drainers off of India, but I think I'm going to go sit like on a peak that's going to start more and more. That's the tight drains. Definitely the section, oh my goodness. Couldn't get underneath it. Might have been able to scoop over the edge, but I'm gonna order another one of these agaves. They are amazing. I'm gonna get it more narrow. Should be perfect. Hyper durable boards, super strong. They take less fiberglass to complete. Technically, they're cheaper to make. Better in every way. Oh, just for the record. So amazing out here, guys. It's this time of year. We go through many, many months of no waves and sometimes the whole year like we surf this place like twice so it's not always waves don't think that this place pumps all the time he has the first real volley of sets hopefully i'm in the perfect spot too deep i went too deep no 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 look at this That was about a six wave set and I didn't get one of them. Not in the right position. I need to try to get some empty so you guys can see. But I'm sort of in between two peaks again. There's one wide. Um, it seems to be the predominant one when the waves are big. And then there's some inside ones on the smaller sets. But I haven't seen a proper one break out yet. But when it does, it's going to be men mental. So it is a beach break setup. Sort of just place myself in the highest probability area at the moment. See what's going to happen on the next bunch of sets and then work out a solution from there. But for now, we just wait in and yeah, waiting patiently, hoping for something. No, we chopped in there. Small wave. That's another one, that one came through wide. There's a bigger one. This is like a fun little runner as well, but I need a bigger one. That would have kept me busy, but that last one I took off on to stay busy, put me out of position on the actual sets. And I hope I didn't get my best wave earlier because I didn't even claim it or give feedback on that because I just thought, wow, nice warm up, pretty good wave. Definitely in for some more. Saw those other ones and uh, just haven't been able to catch another, like even one proper one yet. See them though, they're around. It's a tiny one, I need to keep busy even so I'm such a long wait. 
just over it. We saw waves, but then missed a couple and that was it. The best waves were down there. The bodyboarders are getting it. They're having the best time, but just a couple. Yeah, it's a crazy long wait. I need to remind myself why this inside section is difficult to surf because the truth is you just wait sometimes 40 minutes longest wait ever but uh you get that one wave and it's all worth it but at the same time you you miss a whole bunch of waves down the line so it's one of the reasons why i don't surf up here too much next season i'm going to come and try get one of those crazy ones that we saw in one of my previous videos and yeah pretty much call it after that i need to get one on film like that i've gotten plenty on my own but not on film now super deep not underneath it enough we need to re-strategize guys it looks like my best wave was my first wave I honestly thought i was going to get another better one than that i was looking forward to more but such is uh, the nature of uh, barrel hunting eh on like a sub pass well really it's not a lot of size to it it seems to be dissipating it's a small drainer, but way underneath me. Looking for the biggest set that comes through and it just stacks up on the section will provide such a good POV. One can only hope. We're doing our best, guys. Having a lot of fun. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. It's so weird. Like some of the edits get so many views and then some don't, but we're just going to keep on going with what we have and I'm going to keep on sending it. Thank you. Let's keep going. The only way that we were wanting. Not that one, not big enough. Maybe this one. Yeah, let's go on this one. POV session there guys this is the only perspective we'll get but at least we out here and I'm super stoked that you guys are tuned in I don't know I want a big one the drop <laughs> oh yeah they come you gonna get it dirty chad 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 you know how long i waited for that way pretty much been waiting the whole session for that way Yeah, it is. <laughs> Had all the time in the world to react to that. That was the wave of the day.
I was like quite underneath it already, so I didn't get a, like enough scoop in to get enough speed to like drop down the face. The way bottomed out, and yeah, it's pretty hectic. I keep on saying I want a more maneuverable board, and I think we're going to do them, and uh, you'll see there'll be a big difference. I'll be able to knife the waves a bit easier. I was going to say the transition to enter like heavy uh, waves that are like jacking up really fast. It's so narrow. It's like a foot of water, like a strip that you sort of got to be like at the pinnacle of the speed of your paddle in at that point in time because anything more you'll be way too underneath it and anything less you'll be too above it so it's like such a small degree of like entry point into them Still waiting for that crazy one. I got the one crazy one, but I didn't get the scoop in properly on it, so sort of like it bottomed out and I had no drive for the pump, and that was that. And a bunch of small ones. I'm still trying to get like that dreamer. But they've been dreamers already. I've gotten, I'm happy, but I wouldn't mind one or two more. You're gonna get it! <laughs> Definitely better ways wide. There has been all day, so maybe it's time to make that adjustment. Dude, I love it. Okay, let's talk about that wave. I had the perfect opportunity. I tried to knife the, the corner straight legged and um, I couldn't get an engagement on the rail. Board stayed flat and I just fell over. It's just too wide. I love these boards. They feel the best, but I need a better shape, more dialed in shape. I think for any performance board that I have, any performance step up, 19 point, 19 and a quarter is the max I'll go. 19 and a quarter is the widest I'm going on my boards. This thing's 19.40. Just like conditions are really perfect. There's been some good ways. I messed up some good ones. There are some coming. I'm not quite sure if I'll actually get that dreamer, but I had opportunities to get it. I came close to two of them. I got into the one. The other one, I didn't even get over the edge, and that was pretty much the session. Thanks for watching. As always, I appreciate you guys. I mean, it means so much. Let's just keep going. Getting hustled. I don't want to get hustled too many times, guys. I am going to drop in on people if they do that. <laughs> That's the one, guys. Definitely want that one at a nice corner. Oh. Ah, I collapsed. Ah, I collapsed. Did just get like a little trainer? Oh, yes, sorry, let's go. Not really a trainer. Okay, we're definitely sitting wide now, guys. I have my opportunity on the inside. I'm gonna try to get one of these nugs here. Tactical eject on that one. 
jacked up super fast. Uh, we got the most of it, we made the most of it. I could have paddled out early. I'm pretty stoked. Uh, I haven't got in the wave of the winter for myself this year. I'm pretty bummed about it. Season's almost over and I'm, I'm about to go surf a, a surf contest. So a little bit dismal, but we're going to keep with the uploads and just keep on sending it. And hopefully one day things uh, come together nicely. <laughs> That's all she wrote, eh? I had my opportunities, blew them. Got to look at everything positively and not uh, get bummed, but I wouldn't mind a proper wave of the winter at some point. But the winter's almost over, it's like, we're going into our last month now, and I'm not around for the next, like almost full seven days. But anyway, it's enough of that. See you guys on the next one, Yo. This used to be a beach and there was sand here, but there's no more sand here, because all the sand gets blown onto the road and onto the dunes and it's not picked up and put back on the beach. Another thing I wanted to say, I'm extremely, I am extremely happy with these agave blanks. They hyper durable, extremely durable. I mean, if you guys have been watching my videos, as soon as it gets big, I ride this thing. I pull into a couple mental ones and it's still in one piece. So I'm very happy with them. They also take like less layers of cloth. So you're actually being more like efficient with your board build then. And they have such a nice cork in the water. I love the way that they feel. It's like, to me, how a wooden board should, I would imagine a wooden board would feel like that, just like fully engaged. Like, you know what a PU does compared to an EPS? The Garve is like a PU, but just improved. It's much better, they feel so good. So I'm very happy with them. I wanna get another more dialed in one. And you can see we'll push these things even further than what we have this year. We'll get more out of them. Just need to get it shaped with the right dimensions and uh, we're in business.